Beautiful. All right, first things first. Uh, everything we do for this is basically underground except loading, which is done above ground. So what we need to do first is tie in the fuel. We don't have the fuel. Well, actually, wait. No, we don't need to do any fueling here because the fueling's being done at the other location. So we're good there. So all we need to do is... Uh, let's pop this up. Pop this down. Bring you on over to here. Interact with drone port. Uh, this port is going to be called Mo Power Station Dark Matter Crystal. Mo Power Station Dark Matter Crystal. And what this is going to do is this port. Is going to get all this beautiful dark crystal. And then it is going to take it to main base dark matter crystal. And then when it gets back, it's going to go to this port. It's going to go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth and bring us all manner of stuff. Great. And I think we just did it. We need far more dark matter residue. Okay. We can overclock this. How much are you making? Are y'all full? How are y'all full? Oh, because this is backed up. Yeah, because it's, it's only getting 30. So... If we made this the amount of Sam that's coming in... Okay. So that would be a that would be a perfect production if we did this. So we have uh, what seventy five coming in, because we have three hundred total on that belt. So you can take up to seventy five. Perfect. Okay, great. This is now going to be one to one with our output as well, which is excellent. Okay, so now you're going to one-to-one this. That is a beautiful thing, chat. Okay. So, uh, what we're going to do now is... We need versatile frameworks as well. And I think I might do those right over here. But before we do that, we need to decide, like... Well, first, let's make sure this is working. I think this is working. Oh, did you just take off? Maybe? I wish, dude, it'd be so nice if when you moused over a drone on the map... It showed you the name of where they were heading. That'd be so cool. Ko, considering the progress you've made so far in the game, would you start the game from the beginning? If so, would you do anything differently? So, the short answer is, I can't wait until I get to the point when I want to play this game again. And I can already think of about 3,000 things I'd do differently. Yep. Cool. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah. That's about where we are with that. Okay, we got to head back to our other base real quick. Let's go do that right now. Because we got to set up the dark matter crystal relay to actually take the dark matter crystal from the main sushi belt 
and then put that into our stuff. Because right now, all that dark matter crystal is just going to go into our sushi belt, and then it's just going to go right into the sink because we're not removing it properly yet. The drone has no fuel. So as far as I understand, if you've noticed here, the drone took off. It's not there anymore. And the reason that that happened is because whenever a drone leaves a platform, it always takes enough fuel with it for a round trip. So as long as we are fueling it here, which we are, we are, we do have active fuel going into it here. We never have to worry about fueling it here. Only one station needs the fuel and we are fueling at our other base. Yep. Is Co playing the Alamite DLC? I am tomorrow. Yep. Yup, yup, yup. So calming, so peaceful. Doo, 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 doo. So many deaths, so many deaths. Are portals not worth it? Portals are actually awesome. Um, I'm I'm currently low on one of the resources I need to build the portals, so I'm kind of uh, yeah, still sorting that out a bit. But we're getting there. The next thing we're gonna work on is the oscillators that I need to be slooping the absolute bejeebus out of, apparently because I need them for so many things and we are very, very starved. Why is this not working? There we go. About time I sealed this up. What's the point of putting roofs on buildings? Uh, whenever it rains, the, your machines don't get wet. Wait, there's rain in the game? No. There's no rain in the game. Oh, they actually wanted rain in the game? It got removed, really, it got removed. Why did it get removed? Is it not working right or something? Oh, performance. Okay, that's fair. That's like the one reason I would say that that's a great reason to remove it. Okay. We'll get the rest later. I want to leave the gaps right now. It's because the machines were getting wet, duh. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you for that. With Twitch Prime, my house is haunted by a chicken, a poultry geist, a foul spirit. I plan to call an exorcist to help it cross to the other side. Oh my god. I've, have you ever watched an MMA fight and you see a guy get comboed and he just keeps getting hit and it just like gets worse and worse? That's what that was. That's what that was. It just got, it just kept getting worse and worse and worse. Oh. So, we have a few things to do. First of all, let's go down here. I think our sushi belt is not actually working properly, so the first step is fixing that, because um, that seems to be brokened. And then once we get that right, we need to get the dark crystal stuff going. Make sure that's all good. Our belt is broken. Where are you? Oh. Oh. What? Oh, we had 
to overflow the diamond. going to here basically have to do the same thing here um so little cool trick by the way see how this smart splitter is in i could deconstruct that and do all sorts of stuff and then redo all the belts and do everything or i could just click on this splitter with middle mouse button mouse over this and hold down the control key doop, doop. and most of the time hold on did i do that right that's oh, a merger there's the splitter so that's a smart splitter. Hold control and just replace it. Ba-boom! You'd love to see it. Uh, okay. Crystal this way. Mm -hmm. And overflow that way. Great. And now, we will uppies the crystals into the production line. So we're going to go up. Again, we don't normally do this, but this is one of those situations where it just like, uh, it's one of those resources that just needs to basically work like this on. Oh, no. Now what this is going to do is anytime a dark crystal comes down our sushi belt, which is about to start doing a lot once this stops backing up, anytime a dark crystal comes in, it's going to get shot up here. And all we need to do is basically get this dark crystal into our production lines. Because if we can do that, then it should kind of fire off all the other stuff that needs to happen. So we need to figure out how we want to do this. So right now, this is actually coming down from the top, which is wild. Um, so we're going to do... This needs to come up first. So let's, let's do that first. This is going to be the dark matter crystals from our new dark cradle, uh, dark matter crystal production facility. It's going to go there. And then up here, we just kind of want to feed it in for now. Now we got to make sure we actually see this stuff working first before we get too far with it. Co, if you wouldn't mind, drink some water. Thanks, buddy. I'll finish my coffee, but thank you, man. Okay. Mm. Okay, so. Now what we need to figure out is that's going to bring in a bunch of dark crystal to this floor and help produce that. But as the dark crystal comes out, we need to send some back up to the top. So, how in the bejeebus <laughs> are we going to do that with all this? Um... We could split the incoming, actually. So check this out. If we did this, then we could split it like this. I would need it out that side. Well, actually, you know what? No, I take that back. Hold on. If we were to do this and face it this way, then we could split it like this. And this may not be the prettiest thing, but we could do this. If I were to bring this down here. And then merge it. Wait, this is an outflow that we need to get into this inflow. So I'm going to do a merger. Oh my god, chat. <laughs> what is going on? Okay, um. Oh, this is such a mess. Okay. <laughs> but it might work. So, what we need to do at this point is I need to see this dark matter come into the system and I need to see it working. So, how is our sushi belt looking before we continue? Oh my god. 
this thing is freaking flying. Okay. Um. Okay, I'm seeing crystals coming in. That's great. Let's go see if we can follow some of our dark matter crystals up. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Man, that is a lot of quick wire. That is a disturbing amount of quick wire, chat. Mm. You can see it's even being it's it's being chungus up our production lines and getting filtered out. Wild. Now we may have gotten completely backed up because my sushi belt was a little uh, messed up for God knows how long. Yeah, that's going to take a second. Um, that one's almost done at least. Shouldn't that be moving? I don't understand. Oh. Okay. Are all you Mark 6? We Mark 6 to all of you, right? Thank you, Lathe. Appreciate you, buddy. Thanks, man. Hold up, hold up. Rubber and plastic. Yeah, rubber and plastic shouldn't be coming into this at all. That's weird. And you're feeding directly into the very top belt. Yeah. Interesting. So we're, I, I thought we, we split the plastic completely, but I guess we, we feed it down the main line too. Okay, that's fine. That works. Yo, is that a Mark V? It's a Mark V! There's the, there it is. I was looking for this. What the hell? Wait, what? Is that working? Yeah, it's working. Okay, I was gonna say, what's going on here? Okay, well that's good. And it's gonna be some very nice upgrades there. That should get all this moving a lot faster, which is good too. Like significantly faster. Okay. I will say though, like I'm not really sure. I don't. I don't know if I want. I think I want my main sushi belt, at least for now, to be like. Hmm. I'm a little torn here. Uh, first of all, Exidy. Hey gang, mods and co. Sophie is adorable. Can't wait to see how she grows. I'm not a fan of Satisfactory myself, but it's still enjoyable to watch you play. And while on the subject of building and dad jokes, what's the easiest building to lift up? A lighthouse. Oh, that's good. How, do, how have I not heard that one before? I appreciate that. Griffalion! Hey co, recently my dad went to jail for stealing from his job in road construction. I didn't want to believe it at first, but when I got home, all the signs were there. Classic. Thank you, Griffalion. Oh! Ko, since chat asked for one Sophie emote, I made one. I thought that animated would suit her. It's in the drop box if you want it, Nodders. Yes! I do! All right, one second. Um... Wow, I just I just went to our our animated emote area and you guys use all of these. I don't I don't want to get rid of any of these. Um 
we have an arrive and a leave. Maybe, maybe we can... <laughs> we'll get, we'll, we'll, we'll drop leave for now. Okay, just so we can get this in. All right, give me one sec, chat. Oh, wait a second. It's a replacement emote. Oh, this is even better. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my God, Julia. This is so perfect. Hold on. I'm not gonna tell you what the replacement emote is yet, unless Julia already did. Hey, Julia, can we get one more with Sophie? Um, like as any other emote? That'd be amazing. Oh wait, I gotta, hold on, I gotta attribute it to Julia. We're almost done. Thanks for your patience, Kat. Almost done. There we go. I give you, chat, the new Codink. Awesome. Mm -mm. That is amazing. Julia, thank you so much. I love it. I love it. Mm. Okay. So, let's think. Do I want to tie this line into somewhere different? Um, what the heck is going on here? Wait, what? 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 Why don't you just do that back here, Ko, you dummy? Why do you do that at... God, Asko is so dumb. Okay, one second. Once I gotta clean up for Pasco, apparently. Um, is this right here? What's funny is I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna figure out slash remember why I did it the other way, and the other way was probably much smarter. That's kind of how this this stuff goes, to be honest. So now, see, as we can see here, this now has full 1,200 on this, which is exactly what we wanted. Because we can have the rubber plastic belt back up. That's not, that's not a big deal. That's fine. Uh, Forsaken Elite. One more month before I reach the nice month. Does it come with a nice badge as well? It does. A super nice badge. Well, it should, but I'm not sure. But anyway, thank you so much, Forsaken, with the uh, 68 months. And then we have Danny hey Mac. Co, just had our first baby boy on Wednesday and happy to start him early on your streams. Building the next generation. Yo, congratulations. That's awesome. That is absolutely awesome. Congrats to you and your family. That's great. Um, Y'all, I'm going to be honest. This doesn't look like it's going down at 1,200 rate. Like, ah, uh, maybe. I, it's kind of hard to tell because it's getting full. It's getting filled the second it empties. So, I mean, all this is six. Let's let's do let's do one big check here. Um. Okay, everything here is six. Oh, this does look like it's actually backing up a little bit, if you look at it. Confirmed, this is six. Oh, this is six. Let's just do a quick look down here. Make absolutely sure everything is what it should be. All that's looking good. There goes our fuel. All that's looking good. Chung is singing in a nice clip. That is not updated, but that doesn't really matter. Okay. Most importantly, everything is flowing very smoothly here. It's exactly what we want. Now we need to kind of see if this dark crystal thing is working as it needs to. Oh, wait, we didn't even hook it in yet, did we? We even hook it in yet? No, we haven't even hooked it in yet. Let's hook it in. Okay, now that now that it's here, we can do this. Um, okay, so the way that we're doing the outputs, the way that we're doing the outputs is a little weird. 
because we need to get all of this into the main belt, which is this one. It needs to go into this one. Oh no, that's the fuel. No, no, that's all. That's just all the fuel. Do I even have an output here yet? Wait a second. Oh no, 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 no. We haven't actually done output. We own the only output we have is the rocket fuel right now, I think, because everything else is inputs to other areas. Okay, that's where the confusion was. I don't have an output thing set up yet. The only output thing we have set up, I think, is here. Yep, that's it. So all we need to do here is. Pop this like this. Just like this. It's gonna reconnect as normal. And now we can pull it out on all these other ones super easy. And just put it right in. Bada boom. Chat, it's almost too easy. We'll do it on another line, and that way it doesn't interact with the fuel systems that we have set up. I reversed it. Whoops. My bad. Chad, I messed it all up. Yeah, unfortunately, whenever you put these down, they give you, they give a little bit of a push whichever way the, the unit is facing. So we need to have all these facing in the right direction if we want it all to line up properly. Boom. Boom. Moment of truth, chat. Moment of truth. Mm. Okay. Oh, and there it goes. Hell yeah. Bada boom. So now all this is going up here. This is now being fed into our main production line. Improperly. One second. I'm sorry, this has to look Good up. Good show. Thanks, Ben. Um, there we go. Beautiful. Hey, thank you so much, Estonde with the five bomb. Really appreciate that, dude. Thank you, thank you. Oh, look at all that dark matter going out. Wait, what? Oh, it's going down. Yeah, that's right. So all this is now flowing into here. So the next thing we need to do, we got to get the versatile frameworks going. But before we do the versatile frameworks, we're actually going to figure out what else we need for the, um, the, the super whatever oscillators. Because those we need more than anything else. And I'd like to sleep this as well. These we are so starved on. So starved. 